this is Barbara and um, as it comes the inspiration flows um, independent of linear time and uh, all of a sudden it hit me this is the, the time to make another video. My head's trying to wrap itself around what's going to happen and that's good but I think my mind can just go and rest now for a second. While I say that my shoulders are falling I'm taking a deep breath and um, this video is called I am me and I let them be. I am me and I let them be. This is quite powerful, I can say, for me personally. And uh, it's something that I've dealt with, with for quite a while now. And it's something that keeps coming back to me and keeps coming back to me. So it seems to be one of the challenges that I chose as a soul to bring with me this time around. Um, being here right now on planet Earth, uh, living this human life. And I'm sure I'm not the only one, as um, I look around me, as I talk to my, my friends, as I talk to my family and my soul family, and the network that I'm connected with, I can see it popping up everywhere. So really feel the words, I am me and I let them be. Um, what's the challenge here is to, to work with this from a soul level and connect it with our minds, so that it becomes whole again because we can perceive it on one level and it can be fine on the one level and then on the other level it keeps slipping our minds and I can say yes it happened to me um, a few times and it'll probably happen again yet I know it's vital that we remember this and we've we've all, always known it yet we get distracted easily with everything going on around us and everything going on inside our relationships, inside our families, um, all the people we're connected to. There is so much challenge at the moment and I've been posting recently a lot on Facebook, uh, breathing in love and breathing out peace and it works for me and um, it came from somewhere and I, I posted it out there and then I reread it again and I keep talking to people and we talk about this um, and we repeat it quite regularly and it is it has become a mantra for me and these words I am me and I let them be are also a mantra that I can offer for you today and uh, maybe it is inspiring for you to take this write it down and work with it and see does it ripple through your system and does it connect somewhere deep inside in your heart space in your core in your heart core um, and make make sense does it make sense for you um, lately what has come up for me also is the the speaking up the uh, speaking my my heart truth my personal truth which not necessarily is the, the same truth as everybody else's truth it's connected to this walking my path and being myself and um, stopping to judge myself and also it's about not listening to anybody else judging me anymore and to just push that away and give it back to the people that think they have the right to judge me. And uh, that seems to be a collective topic right now for so many people because we have been conditioned while we grew up in this society to listen to what everybody else says and thinks and we have been, I've, I can say about myself for a long time, I always tried to climb into other people's heads to figure out what they might actually think and um, since since I I, I woke up um, to my, my own awareness really, uh, I, I, this is something that can't constantly comes back to me and I remind myself often to stop trying to climb into other people's head because it's their head. It's their head, it's their heart, it has nothing to do with me. Yes, maybe sometimes something resonates and then I maybe I can I need to take it personal and then I can let it go through my system and see where do I connect with it and where can I optimize uh, my behavior, my feelings, what is it that I can let go of or is it anything that I need to bring balance to inside myself. Inside myself are the magic words here, are the door. Um, because there is nothing else really and when we work on ourselves we can start healing and many of us have already started to do that and we're continuing to do that and when we do that we can then by just being the way we are 
support others on their walk. Maybe we inspire them by things that we say or maybe we just inspire them by being ourselves. Maybe we work as coaches, as therapists, as, um, as soul guides or healing guides. Um, it doesn't really matter. Um, what matters is that we really focus on ourselves and that we are strong um, in standing in our own truth right now and that we are strong in speaking our mind and especially speaking our heart. And uh, when we realize that we can only really heal ourselves and that with this realization also comes the realization with healing ourselves, we're healing the world because in the end we are all connected and we are all one, which the mind just goes, whoa, this is such a big thing, this is the big picture. And my mind then goes back to creating puzzle pieces and, and big question marks. Yet in our hearts, that's where, where it really counts. In our hearts, we know these things. And all the wisdom is, is already there. And this is the message from, from my heart to your heart to really listen. I am me and I let them be. Let them be. Let everybody be the way they are and Take your focus away from them. Take your focus back to, towards yourself and stop distracting yourself from your own path by following somebody else's path, by um, having your attention on somebody else's decisions, choices, behaviors, actions. Come back to yourself and come back to your own senses. This is what, what really, really matters and this is what I call soul matters. So keep walking and um, keep inspiring yourself and by that inspiring others and keep breathing and this is what it's all about breathing once we stop breathing we stop existing as a human being but our soul doesn't really mind yet we're here by choice right now and we have a job we have a purpose we might know about it and we mightn't what matters is that we walk our walk the best that we can and that we continue to focus on ourselves um, with a deep love that comes from our heart. Listen to this voice from inside of you. Listen to your heart and uh, maybe affirm with me, I am me and I let them be. So blessings. This is Barbara. Bye bye.